I see a snake too. I'm gonna show you on his belly. These rings don't go all the way around like my pearls. I mean, he is tiny. Look at his yellow tail. snake up here. It looks like a rat snake. I'm not exactly sure what it is. Oh yeah. Jello rat snake. Hey, hey, this is the first rat snake of the season. Look at that guy all kinked up. Just beautiful. Snakey o Should turn the stupid car off, huh? This is a this is an adult rat snake, more than likely. He's uh right around three feet long, maybe a little bit longer. Turn this car off. Oh, wants to be a little bit feisty here. Nah. I'm looking at the light. Curious little snake. Uh uh, no, no, no. All right, Snake, it's time for you to go, buddy. Come on, you can go. Uh oh, let's go that way. There we go. Okay, you've got a little red bellied water snake, plain bellied water snake right down here. Oh, he's alerted. She's alerted. Cool. All right, Ribbon Snake, you got to go, buddy. Cool. What do we have here? Oh, a garter snake. Hello, little garter snake. What's going on? How about we try to get you off the road? Yeah? Ooh, you're feisty, huh? You're so feisty. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go, 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 go. All right. Off the road. And in the middle of May, I did a herping trip to Florida. Everything started out great, but then it got weird. Strange. Unusual, even. But don't have a pity party for me, because after a few days, I was finding snakes again back home. Three snakeless days in Florida, and a long morning of no snakes, and look what we have. Beautiful rough green snake. Hey buddy. Awesome, awesome, awesome. This is the first snake I've seen alive since we saw the pygmy rattlesnakes. And that was, what? Four days ago, five days ago. 
I knew today would be a decent day. The temperatures are perfect and it is humid. So if you've never seen the belly of one of these snakes, check that out. It's beautiful. All right, Snakey, we're gonna take you on over the, to this side of the road here. There you go. And it melts into the bush. Got a glass lizard. I don't normally like to pick them up, but I want to get it off the road. Actually, they just burned this right here. So I'm going to put them on the other side of the road. All right, glass lizard. There you go. See, big old dump truck coming right now. And this side is all burned. Second rosy wolf snail. Uh oh, it's kind of alerted. Come on. Let's get you over here. The reason I'm helping these wolf snails is because we're in a drought and, uh, you know, it's not good for snails to be crossing sandy roads like this. I see a snake too. snake we're in a drought Let's see if we can get this corn snake to drink I guess not Let's see here Calm down, calm down, calm down. It's drinking. Thank you. Hope you enjoyed your water. All right, corn snake. Take off, buddy. These are just superficial wounds, of course. Moving on. Hey, rat snake. What's going on? I think I'll get my GoPro. Hopefully it doesn't take off. Let's see if we can get it to drink.
well, it's completely hiding. I see it drinking. I see it drinking. All right, rat snake. I am going to take you over another burned forest. You can see how how it's burned like that. All right. Have a good one. From World Day weekend. Have a great weekend. Looks like a deadly coral snake to me. Red on yellow, kill a fella, red on black. There you go, Jane. Somebody hold the light. Got it. Okay. Wanna hold you the know, light? I feel bad for him. I but look, should... I'm gonna show you on his belly. These rings don't go all the way around like on a coral snake. Oh. oh. And they specialize on eating other eggs of uh, reptiles. Little eggs. Little eggs, right. We're gonna, to we're gonna put them off the road. We're gonna put them off the road. Think he doesn't like that? No. Plus, he's a snake. <laughs> he's gonna go. He's gonna say. We're gonna take him. We're gonna help him over. Let's go. Come on. These are these are almost as big as they get. They get a little bit bigger. All right, come on. It's like he's moving in the air. And people, people hardly, they don't know what they are when people see them. He's on the move too. Yeah. I mean, he is tiny. Look at his yellow tail. Oh yeah. See, he, he'll wiggle that around and attract uh, little things to come eat it. Have you ever seen one that small? Tail. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I've seen one a little bit smaller than that. Really? The green tail is, that's the, that's the sign. Yeah. They're so pretty. I don't know how you saw that. I guess you're looking for um, I, I, I just saw it. Well, you know, I, I've been looking at pine straw, so. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, cool. Man. See if we can get him off the road. See if he's going to be cooperative. All right, little copperhead. Go, 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 buddy. Awesome. Butterflies are feeding on the yellow rat snake. Now we've got a dead corn snake. I don't know what happened to it. Probably it was run over, uh, but I did see a large hawk nearby. I don't know if it had anything to do with it. Poor guy. Well, when I got out of the car to check at the corn snake, uh, I looked down and I saw this. This is uh, looks like a decay snake, maybe. Uh, Red bellied snake, I'm not sure exactly what it is. Anyway, he's pretty crispy. It would be a new species for this road. I'll just take him home actually and uh, take a look at him. And that's what the little snake turned out to be the red bellied snake, Storaria occipitamaculata. The name is longer than the snake. Hey, so thanks for coming along. We'll see you on the next one.